Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on what time you're watching this video. Hi, this is your girl Tara Tara Love Diva. Welcome to my channel and do me a favor, comment, like, and subscribe and share this video if you are down to rock with your girl Tara Tara Love Diva. Hey there, my beautiful souls. I am Tara Love Diva and I am thrilled to welcome you back to my channel. Here's a colorful combination of everyday life rap together through the art of vlogging from styles and beauty to clever money management advice planning hacks and the magic of journaling thank you all so much for joining me on this incredible journey your support means the world to me if you enjoy what you saw today and want to even more content be sure to hit the subscribe button and turn on the notifications so you never miss a new video also don't forget to follow me on all my social media channels for behind the scenes fun updates and exclusive content let's stay connected and continue to inspire each other every step of the way until next time stay fabulous and keep spreading the love bye for now Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. I don't know what time. I need to pull this picture down some. It just don't look right like that. Good morning. I'm still renovating. <laughs> Hold on. My brain just went everywhere because I seen whatever. Um. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on what time you're watching this video. Hi! This is your girl, Tara Tara Love Diva. I know you seen my AI at the beginning. I'm trying new stuff because the AI is not going anywhere. So I, I love... I'm going to say all this before I get to the rest of the video. I love what's coming next because I don't know if you all remember or if you might be too young for it, but Google it. The Jetsons when the whole house was futuristic. I used to love watching that cartoon. Meet the Jetsons. You know, everything is copywritten. So... I used to watch that and be like, oh, I can't wait until we get X, Y, and Z, A, B, C. We're getting it. We're getting it now in my age range, and I'm way up there in the 50s. I'm 55. So, I, I'm trying out these new AI stuff. I, I, I adore, I embrace what's coming next because it's not going anywhere. I get people, well, let me get to the, my rest of my intro. If you are new, welcome to my channel. And if you're an OG, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to a day in the life of Tara Love Diva. But really a week in the life of Tara Love Diva. But it's going to be a... I don't know how I'm going to do this. Because once again, I keep forgetting to pick the camera up. And then when I do pick the camera up, I'm thinking it's recording. Because, you know, I'm in the middle of doing something. I can't stop and say, ooh. It's not hard to do. People say, oh, it's easy to do. You just turn a camera on. It's not easy because sometimes you be so busy you thought you turned the camera on or you're not noticing your memory is full or the battery is low and you're doing what you're doing and nothing got captured. Like today. <laughs> nothing I did today was captured. Which was like so... My wig is like letting up because I've been trying on hair. Um... Which is in the video. Um, pretty much nothing I did this morning. And it's after my lunchtime. And I'm like, let me check while I'm eating the footage. Man. Nothing. Nothing. Now I'm looking at it and it says record. But if I'm not looking at Okay, this hair is synthetic. It's like everywhere. Um, so... No footage from this morning, and I'm captured a few things on my phone, but not on my camera. Oh, that that kind of hurt your feelings because I was doing something very almost not important, but it's the fact that I film a day in my life. So, with that being said, this hair need to knock it off. The strings keep going, getting attached to my eyelashes and my lip gloss. Come on. It's here. It's here. Oh, there we go. Found it. Get off. Is it that? This is what I've been doing because the hair gets staticky. So, with that being said, a day in the life is 
everything I do in the, from the time I wake up to the time I start working at, I don't know, whatever time I start working, I'm going to have to change this around because this, I don't like how that is in my cam. I need to bring it down or just take it off and put something else up. I'm not liking that. I mean, if you don't know what it is, it's this. It's her. It's hard to see because of, oh, there we go. It's her. And then those up there, I'm changing this decor. I'm not actually liking the back, back of the wall that I have here. But I love that shelf back there. But anyway. So, the day in the life, what I did this morning, let me give you a breakdown. I got up this morning, of course. I did my workout. I then went back upstairs. I showered, brushed my teeth. Did all what I needed to do filming for a brand, which is this hair that was sent to me. Um, I'll put the info at, in the link down below. It's all synthetic hair, which I'm loving the synthetic for the summertime because I could just get up and go and, you know, instead of have to curl my hair and it gets humid, hot, and rainy, and then my hair drops and I'm in the middle of a day and I'm looking like a hot mess. So, I welcome synthetic right now. Um, uh, what else I do? I did the try on haul, which that video is coming soon. I'm going to have to re-edit from... She and she and sent me a bunch of stuff, so I did a try on haul. Um, I also did a try on haul for Amazon finds. A company on Amazon sent me a cup, a few things, so I did a lot of things. All of that's not gonna be posted at one time. You just get clips of what I was doing. Um, what else I did this morning? My day starts at six fifty nine seven ish, seven thirty ish. I get up in the morning, I say, thank you, Jesus. I don't do a long out prayer like most people say. Girl, I'll be taking an hour. I don't need an hour to tell the Lord thank you. I wake up grateful and I'm thankful every morning that I get to wake up if I go to sleep. Because sometimes I have nothing but insomnia. But if I can get up off their bed, it's thank you, Jesus. So what they'll be saying, I get up and I write in my journal. Dear me, give me five minutes. Take five minutes and clear your mind. Oops, sorry. Everything you did yesterday, get it off your brain. Sometimes I do it at night because, you know, I have so much going on. And then I also write in my journal that is actually on sale on Amazon. Is it getting it? So I write in this journal. It has a guide inside the journal. For journaling it has that in there so I do that in the morning while I'm listening to me some Luther that's it's that's a thing that's going to happen so I listen to my Luther that's my alarm clock at 10 to start my day because my day work day starts at 11 to be honest so after I do all the writing in my journal and I sit there and I self-reflect and I say woosa. I check some emails, some important emails, whatever pops up on my screen. And then when I go have my coffee in the morning and sometimes coffee and breakfast, I sit down and finish, you know, go through all my emails, whatever brand hit me up, da 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 da. X, Y, and Z. After I do that, I go down, come, I came downstairs to my gym, which is in the basement. And the reason why I like it in the basement to get you up to get moving. And plus that's only spot the buddy because I don't want it in my house and, and the rest of my decor because it's not cute at all. Plus I have a whole gym. Um, so I get on the treadmill. I get on my um, shaker and I do the stepping thing and I do a couple of weights. I might do a whole video on it. No, I'm not because I don't like filming me working out. I, I don't see the point. I just show you clips of what I do in the morning. There you go. Because I'm not doing a whole session of workout. I think that's, to me, boring. I wouldn't even watch people that do workout videos. So, with that being said, as you can see on the thing back there, if you can see it, it is April 23rd, 2024. Um, after the workout, I went upstairs, did a shower. I did a um, small face beat. It's been since... 
now it's about it was a it was about 9 30. i did a face beat and it is right now alexa what time is it it's 3 21 p.m it's 3 21 p.m after i had lunch and my face beat my light is a lot of lighting it's lighting right now um maybe i could turn it down how you turn it down somewhere on this camera I'm still, oh, there we go. That's too dark. Let's see. Let's see. Come on, thing, catch my face. What are we doing? Okay. There we go. I think I was too light because of the lighting in my basement sucks. If anyone knows about lighting that lives in the state of Georgia and it's the midtown of where I live at. Hit me up. <laughs> I'm not telling my address. Anyway, so after I did all of that, um, what was the last thing I said? Oh, I showered, did my face beat. Just the basic. I just put on moisturizer, did the um, Maybelline primer, and then I put on the powder. I don't put on foundation just to sit in the house because my skin is starting to look beautiful, if I can say so at 55. Um, except I, who cares? Now you do. But, um, so I did that this morning, and then I, um, after the face beat and I got dressed, I did a little dance video, which is on Instagram. Um, real. Then I did a few videos that I will edit and post on social media sometime today or tomorrow. Some Sometimes my videos are day late, so, because I get all into business and stuff, got to do marketing for my my business. I'm still building a website off of Canva, because um, I'm not doing a whole website because I don't need one. Um, I replied to some mail, um, some comments that everybody left. So, stuff like that, that's all I did today, Tuesday, April 23rd. So, after lunch is now when I'm filming this because, like I said, during lunch I went to check the videos, the, the footage, and there was no footage, which was annoying. So, that's pretty much a day in my life on Tuesday. Now, later on today, well, I had lunch. I had pizza for lunch. It's a New York style pizza. I had that for lunch. And now I'm back in my office. I'm doing some more work. Um, I'm still organizing my down here because I have a talk station over here for when I'm doing my Women 15 and Beyond. I um, have to make a sign to go up behind so that, you know, it's Women 15 and Beyond. Let's talk. It's not a talk show and it's not a podcast. It's just something I'm going to do and put it on. What's this thing here? YouTube. Um, it's for women my age. You know, you start from, 40, I would say 45 and up because at 45 you can get menopause. Some people don't think so, but you can. Ask your doctor. And I always say consult your doctor before you listen to fake doctors. I'm not a fake doctor. I get information from my doctors. And once again, everybody's body is different. So with that being said, I want to do that because I do want to talk. That's important. It's very important because this is why I started my journaling business. Because we self-care, self-care beyond the age of 50. I would say still 45 and up. Menopause, when it kicks in. It changes your mindset. It kind of didn't change mine because I didn't know I was really going through it. And we're going to have a whole story. Actually, I did a video on my journey, beginning journey of menopause. It's, it's a mental health thing. It, it becomes a mental health thing. And I do want to do a journal on mental health for women with that is on what well, beginning stages of menopause. Because when I became menopausal, it, it, your body goes through so much. You you have that, you know, I'm a nympho. I'm not even going to lie. I was, I'm a nympho. But when I got the, the menopause, 
the menopause didn't stop me from wanting sex. It was my mindset of what the fuck is going on. I was trying to get to know who I was with menopause. Let's put it that way. So I'm going to have a whole section of talking about that coming very soon. That's why it's called Women 50 and Beyond. So that's that little section over there. I'm going to put my TikTok link. You can go to my TikTok link and it shows you the section when I was painting it. And then over here is when I'm creating my books and stuff. You know, because I do a lot. I, I have sewing projects coming up. I have books projects coming up with journals and planners. I also made myself a planner for my... um. For my social media content so I can stay organized. I'm always organized, but I different planners are for different different things. This here is made out of cutting mats that you cut your food on. So I got it from Dollar Tree. Dollar twenty five tree. Um Dollar Twenty Five Tree, five dollars and up. Uh <laughs> this is a cutting mat, so I made it as my cover because this is what my planner looks like. This is my social media planner. Um, it has the daily, has daily, weekly, monthly. Then you have the social media tracker. You have social media product reviews. You have my YouTube vlogs. Then the YouTube vlogs from my cooking channel. And then you have my notes. So this is all that's in this journal. And I created this for myself. I, it's not for sale. It takes a lot of work to do that. So this is. That's what happened on my day of Tuesday the 23rd. But I also have other stuff going on. I have a cookie channel. Um, I have to start doing stuff on my cooking channel. Um, I don't know if I want to do faceless cooking channel or I'm just going to do just talking through the, what I'm making. I'm not sure yet, but that's coming soon. My cooking channel, I'll put it down in the link below or on the screen right here. But that's that. And I'm not going to talk your ear off. So I'm sorry I didn't get to show you anything that I made I mean, that I did today because I thought I was filming. Unfortunately, I did. So, thank you for watching. This is your girl, Tara Tara Love Diva. Ta-da!